Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Everything has its use. carry a little of everything here. You've got an eye for quality, friend. 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 Hope to see you again soon. My instruction comes at a high price.
Don't neglect your daily studies. done it this time. Well, if it isn't Borthus. What's wrong? That was a legendary sigh. Yuri, pal! Hear me out for a sec, will ya? They were these mercs, and I may have made a bet with them. Yeah, yeah. You lost, I get it. But we've got bigger issues to discuss. Must be a pretty big deal if it's more important than me losing my dinner to those mercs. It's come to my attention that one of my business associates is looking for a certain giant broke fool. What? That's it? I'll just break him in half and then we can move on with our lives. Not a problem. I figured you'd say that, which is exactly why I came to tell you not to. See, this particular associate hires out quite a few of my people. I can't have a bruiser like you turning them into corpses. Can't I just rough them up enough to get them off my back? A few broken bones never killed anyone. Come now. You know there's no way I'd let you get away with that. I'd use every last one of my contacts to make sure you never win another bet for the rest of your life. Whoa, cut a guy a break, would ya? I wouldn't put it past you to actually follow through. I take it we've reached an understanding, then. I suggest you lay low until things blow over. Clear? Even after all this time, your ability to enrage people still manages to astound me. Hey, it's not as bad as it used to be. The price on my head's never been lower. On the flip side, the price for my skills has only gone up. I've been making money hand over fist as a mercenary. But the stakes keep getting higher and higher, so my pockets remain as empty as ever. I can't help but sigh in disappointment listening to you talk. Haven't you ever heard of self-control? <laughs> Alright, I hear you. But enough about me. What have you been getting up to since you left Abyss? Oh, I just went back to my old gang. They were my home before the Officer's Academy, after all. But I still had to take on some mercenary work to keep my people fed and things running smoothly. It's been a rough couple of years, and thanks to that, my once stunning physique has been spoiled by all this muscle. <laughs> really? You still look pretty scrawny to me. Your skill with the blades improved, though, that's for sure. Well, when you're forced to fight, you either improve or you die. Still, I've got nothing on you. You practically live for a good brawl, after all. These fists have never let me down. No matter the enemy, I'm always the one who walks away. Say, Yuri, I just had a brilliant idea. I have a feeling I'm going to regret asking. But sure, let's hear it. If this associate of yours doesn't catch me, you and your underlings are gonna have to take responsibility, right? Most likely. I knew what I was getting into when I told you to back down. I've made my peace. Yeah? Well, I'm not about to leave my buddy Yuri holding the bag while I sit on my hands. Balthus? So, to make things fair, let's have ourselves a little wager to decide which of us is going to take the fall. That way, if you lose fair and square, it'll give you an out, yeah? You'll have no other choice but to take your goons back from that client, and they won't get pummeled by yours truly. Problem solved! Hypothetically, if I were to take this bet, what happens if you lose? I'll do what I always do. Take my shirt off, jump out in front of them, and run away as they look on in awe. 
This is what I get for trying to help. You love taking off your clothes almost as much as you do gambling. No wonder your pockets are always empty. to go. Any result's a good result. Well, well. Might I borrow you? Preferences. Clever. Show you what a mercenary can do. Understood. Let's clean up.
battle. Let me taste death. I'll do whatever it takes. Here I go. No, they must learn who they're up against. Not a problem. I've got this. I've got it. Let's give it a shot. Starting the mission. Is... Stand back! Looks like Take we got breather. a live one! Time to get in there and fight! Take this! Bear witness! Sequential. Is that an order? Go. No mistakes. They must learn who they're up against. Not a problem. I've got. Watch this. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
Hey there, Shamir. What's a gal like you doing in a place like this? Oh, it's you. What do you want? Nothing in particular. Just had some time to kill. Thought it'd be nice to chat. Shouldn't you and Caspar be off punching things? That sounds nice and all, but I've had my eye on you for a while. Try anything funny and you'll regret it. Oh, take it easy, pal. I didn't mean it like that. I was just thinking the two of us have got a lot in common, yeah? Nothing comes to mind. Hey now, let's not be too hasty. Take gambling, for instance. I happen to know you like a little game of chance, and I fancy a wager myself every now and again. <laughs> you can't call it gambling if all you do is lose. Sure, I've probably lost more than I've made, but hey, that's part of the fun, right? Keep telling yourself that. What about booze? From what I understand, you're quite the drinker. But unlike you, I can actually hold my liquor. Hey, that was one time. Nobody drinks Balthus under the table. Not unless I've lost a bet. You must lose often. I've seen you stumbling around here quite a bit. All right, so gambling and booze are out. What about fighting? The battlefield is where we both come alive, yeah? My fighting style is nothing like yours. I can't argue with that. I like to get in real close and crack some skulls. Well, you prefer to pick off enemies from a safe distance. But even if our methods are different, the end result is the same. It's kill or be killed out there. Huh. So you do see how we're different. Give me some credit, will ya? I might not be the best drinker or gambler. But I am the desirable king of grappling. I can tell you're not looking for your fights to be a bloodbath, unlike yours truly. Because I don't like dying, I prefer to be the one doing the killing. That's why I use a bow. The only one who bleeds is the enemy. Aren't you forgetting something? After gambling and booze, you're supposed to ask me about women. Though I doubt our tastes are similar. Wait, what's that supposed to mean? Hey, Shamir! Where are you going? Huh. Wonder what that was about. Hey there. Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Everything has its use. I will prepare this scarlet path. I don't care much for battle. I am ready to be battling. I have to do my best. I'll show you what a mercenary can do.
The fight starts now. Let's go, everyone. Yeah, we can win this. I'll do my best. I'm a little nervous about this. Right then, let us go to work. <laughs> I will see my duty done. Begin. The Sky Spirit watches over me. Not a problem. I've got this. Leave this to me. Yeah, right. I have you all. Stun fighter. One step closer to my- Fight like this! I'm bleeding all over the place! This captures a big win for our side. It's no use. We can't gain any ground. Orders have been carried out. Now then. Not a problem. I've got this. Right then. Let us go. <laughs> What comes next? Don't let it go to your head. What's next? Wait. You're here to help, are you not? Begin. I am advancing. I do hope you'll make this fun. I'll do my best. I'm a little nervous about this. Stand back. You shall pay for this, if you hear. <laughs> Ill afford defeat here. We're not losing to anyone. in our favor. 
I was prepared for this. Let us go t <laughs> I will see my duty done. Begin. The Sky Spirit watches over me. I'm swapping in! <laughs> Have to keep the momentum going. the next order. Right then. Let us go to work. <laughs> I will... I'll do my best. I'm a little nervous about this. Begin. The sky. Take a breather. Don't mind if I do. Is it my turn? Our fight is for a cause of nobleness. <laughs> to kid. This will help everyone out.
supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Everything has its use. Care to make yourself useful? Must do our fair share. Hunger is the true enemy. This is great. I bet anyone would love this stuff. <laughs> wow! That hit the spot! I'm so glad we're friends! I like this a thousand times more than those fancy dishes. Come back whenever you're hungry. Hunger is the true enemy. Solid, solid. Marianne, you shouldn't just eat in silence. I'm sorry. I don't really know what to talk about. Come back whenever you're hungry. You've still got some food left. You don't want it? That Agma Wolverine meat's super hard to come by, you know. Oh, I don't really eat meat. You can have it. Don't mind if I do then. You know, I always feel strangely energized after eating this stuff. <laughs> you look so pleased to be eating it. It's not every day I get to hear you laugh. Did I look funny or something? No, it's just that the look on your face made me feel happy. 
Instead of just watching other people stuff their faces, maybe you'd enjoy trying some yourself? I am perfectly content just watching. Huh. Well, anyway, it seems like you've gotten more comfortable eating with me, Marianne. I have. When you told me not to act like someone I'm not, at first I didn't know what to do with myself. But I still thought I could learn something from you. And as I talked with you more, I just got used to us seating together. I see. Then why not branch out and eat with other people too? Mealtimes are a great opportunity to make new friends after all. Making conversation and sitting around the dinner table go hand in hand. That's how we ended up friends, right? It might be a good chance to get to know someone else. What's wrong? I'm sorry, it's just... My adoptive father said the same thing to me once. He did? He often criticized me because I avoided other people so much. He said that, as the heir to House Edmund, I must be at least somewhat sociable. But he never bothered to understand how difficult it was for me to do that. But you managed to make friends with me. I'm sure if you keep at it, you'll be able to overcome any difficulties. Maybe you're right. But I don't think it's a good idea for me to get involved with too many people. Why? I only bring misery and misfortune to anyone who gets too close to me. That's not true at all. Why do you even think that? It is true. I know it. Okay, if that's the case, then how is it possible for us to be hanging out right now without any problems? You're right. I should have been more vigilant and kept some distance between us. But you're so kind and I just like being around you. I'm sorry. I'll stay as far away from you as I can from now on. I should go. Hey, wait! Uh, Marianne! <sighs> what am I gonna do about her? Um, may I speak with you a moment? Oh, yeah. I was just about to take a break. You need something? relationship has been strained for a while, so I thought it was time to resolve our issues. Uh, it has? Yes. At least I felt that way ever since the incident. Oh, you mean that time I found you hiding out and chowing down on some pastries? I didn't think anything about that. And I didn't tell anyone either. No, not that. Well, yes, there was that. But there was another, more defining incident. Remember? Are you talking about the time I treated you like a kid and you got all mad? Yes, of course that's what I'm talking about. That happened a long time ago. Has it really been eating at you ever since? Well, I mean... I was unable to maintain my composure and got rather aggressive with you over trivial details. I kept telling myself that I had to apologize, but I could never bring myself to do it. But now, I'm... Uh, I'm sorry. Well, I'd like to apologize too. I should have been more careful with what I said. Why does being called a kid upset you so much? If you don't think of yourself that way, then any comments of the kind should be like water off the duck's back. Look, I'm a tiny bit younger than everyone else, and it doesn't help that I'm shorter, too. Plus, I do have somewhat of a baby face. Really? You don't look that young to me. You... you don't think so? Yeah, 
Now that I really look at you, I think you're a very pretty young woman. And you act real mature, too. Oh, no. I'm not really. Uh, but most importantly, your skill at commanding troops puts all the real adults to shame. Hold on. Real adults? So what you're saying is that I'm ultimately still just a child? Ah, oh, crud. I misspoke. What I meant was... There you go. Making excuses again. Now I know exactly what you think of me. Uh, this conversation's going sideways again, isn't it? Huh. It would seem so. Though, I suppose forgiving you would be the mature thing to do. Hey, there you go. See? You are a real grown-up, Lysithia. Something about this still rubs me the wrong way, but... Oh, fine. I just ask that you keep treating me like the adult I am. As I told you before, I do not have a crest. Why do you insist on hiding it? It can only mean your crest is somehow... Please stop! What's going on here? Lysithia! What were you saying about crests? Go on. I study them every day without fail, so this is extremely relevant to my interests. I do hope you have proof of your theory, though. Spewing out unfounded platitudes will just lead to consequences you definitely don't want. I might not look it, but I'm a general in this army. Ah, well, we were just finishing our conversation. Now, if you'll excuse me. Um, thank you, Lysithia. Think nothing of it. I stepped in of my own accord. <sighs> you appear to hold a secret or two regarding crests. Um... Well... No need to answer. We all have things we prefer to keep hidden. <sighs> Still, your situation hits rather close to home for me. Perhaps... Too close. What? So if you ever need assistance, don't hesitate to ask. We secret keepers need to hold strong with each other after all. <clears throat> oh, and I'm not saying this because I pity you. But you clearly find your secret painful. In light of this, maybe I've been bit too harsh on you in the past. Oh no, you haven't been harsh at all. I'm merely envious of how strong and level-headed you always appear to be. I never would have guessed you hold a closely guarded secret just as I do. I'm not gonna tell you, if that's what you're after. Yes, I suspected as much. Still, perhaps you would be willing to hear mine one day? I feel like being around you gives me the courage to finally set it free. I would be happy to hear you out, and also to help rectify the situation if possible. I know quite a bit about Crest's scholarship. That fool talking to you earlier couldn't hold a candle to me. Thank you, Lysithia. I already feel a little bit braver. I'm offering you the full might of my assistance. I hope you can do better than a little. Um, I mean a lot. I know I'm going to feel a lot braver.
going to doze off. I just know it. Fight starts now. You need not risk your life to protect this position. Together, we can be turning the tides. Out of the way! Take you aid us. Oh, if I must. Leave this to me. Begin. The Sky Spirit watches o- I'll do my best. I'm a little- Out of the way! Here to help. Leave this to me. I have I'll do my best. I'm a little nervous about what a pain. Sorry. Let's take it for ourselves. Oh, if I must. Leave this to me. I'm swapping it. You'll make this fun for me. Begin. The Sky Spear. Take a breather. <laughs> All would be lost if I were to die here. All done. What is the next order? My turn. Not a problem. I'm here to help. One step closer to my goals. I'll do my best. I'm a little nervous about... <laughs> Don't pain. let it go to your head. Attack! Don't let it go to your head. Battle? Oh, if I must. Leave this to me. Is it my turn? I know things are tough, but we can't afford to lose hope. I'm dragging the others down. Begin. The Sky Spirit watches over me. I'll do my best! I'm a little nervous about this. I can't just sleep. That was for tears. Those 
still turn it around. Always don't prepared. lose hope. Behold, a token effort. How's this? Could I am reluctant to do this? I can see no other choice. I'm dragging the others down. I... War feeds my body and mind. Have finished with... Begin. The Sky Spirit watches over. Great success. This will you in a bad spot. God tastes more bitter. Sorry. Black is coffee. All done. What is the next order? Oh, if I leave this... Hey, Swappy! Take a breather! I've gained control of the strong. Leave this to me! I won't say it! I've got you now! I'll do my best! I'm a little nervous about this. Begin! The Sky Spirit watches over me. My turn. I'm swapping in. I can't just see. Let's move. Behold, a token effort. How's this? So this is defeat. I'm sorry. Yes, we did it. Let's take it for ourselves! You know what they say about playing with fire. to me. Is it my turn? Let's do this! You like that? It is done. I'm sorry. We weren't strong enough. I have finished with great success. Begin. The sky. What a pain. Leave this to me. I'll do my best. I'm a little nervous about this. Have to keep the momentum going. The enemy's stronghold will be ours. Is it my turn? 
Just in case. the next order. Oh, if I might, leave this to me. Do my best! I'm a little nervous about this. Begin! The Sky Spirit watches over me. Take a breather. Can swap what a pain. How can I face my comrades after this? Middling results. Perhaps even adequate. You can reward me by letting me sleep in. Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Everything has its use. Ah, it's you. How's it going? Any developments to report? You mean with my power? Not really, no. Hmm. Perhaps using it regularly won't be enough to provoke growth. Good to know. <sighs> hey, I thought you said you weren't interested. I mean, how many times are you gonna come ask me if anything's changed before you're happy? Weren't you the one so keen on piquing my interest? 
I only wanted to check how that was going. If you don't think it's possible, just tell me and I'll stop asking. Okay, yeah, it's definitely not happening. What? But this was all your idea. How cruel of you to stoke my excitement only to back out at the first sign of adversity. Come on, just keep trying a little longer. How about this? Describe the circumstances in which you first awaken to your power. Maybe we can reproduce the situation and see if lightning doesn't strike twice. Well, I was staring death in the face when it happened. I'd been beaten so badly I could barely stand. But I kept telling myself I wasn't ready to die yet. Then, out of nowhere, it just... came to me. Hmm. I suppose we shouldn't try to recreate those conditions. Nobody wants a dead officer on their hands. Let's consider some other potentially relevant factors. Who was your opponent? Where did the struggle take place? What time of day was it? Do you think your emotions played any part in it? I was fighting the Ashen Demon of all people. I hope we get the chance to cross swords again someday. As for the when and where, we were in a forest, at night, and pretty sure it was a full moon too. And that leaves my emotional state. But I don't know how I could replicate the intense emotions of being at the brink of death like that. I see, I see. That context would prove quite tricky to simulate. And if your power functions similar to a crest, revealing itself even when you don't intend it... That leaves only one option. Observing you on the battlefield at all times. Ugh, this is turning out to be more work than I signed up for. Hey, weren't you telling me not to give up just a second ago? If I can do it, then so can you. Hmm, I'm not so sure. <sighs> Goodness, I slept too much. A little fishing ought to snap me right awake. I am hearing you, Linhart. Apparently so. Care to fish with me? Ah! Or what watery expanse will star hooked morsel fly? What pricing denizen dost thou... The... Nay, thou! Dost thou be intending to make thy quarry? Um... In days of yore, I oft partooketh of the angler's art. Yea, forsooth, I was being quite adept. But in this place, thou art knowing thy waters better. Mayhap thou art being my guide? Eth? Oh, that is wonderful. Is this about that love letter? You did say you were going to study up on the old speech. I was wondering why you were assaulting me with so many thees and thous. Fordland's old tongue gives me much more difficulty than the young one. Absolutely. Most people struggle to even write that way, let alone speak it. I'm in awe of you, Petra. What you've done is very, very impressive. I bet you could scour the continent and only find a handful of people who can form such sentences. I mean, people haven't spoken that way since the goddess herself walked the land. So speakers of this style are rare? I have been trying with hardness to learn how to be speaking like everyone else in Fodlin. And now I am finding success, but in the wrong century. I think you should be proud. This only goes to show how much of an aptitude you have for languages. You're not even from Fodlin, and you can out-thou the best of us. That's fascinating. 
Thou art extremely fascinating, Petra. <laughs> I am not understanding the funniness. Do the people of Fodlin truly never speak in this way? Usually only if they're a professional actor or trying to make a bit of a joke. But perhaps you're about to usher in a major comeback. In fact, I think we should schedule some time for you to coach me, Professor Petra. Me teaching you? <laughs> that idea is a wonderful one. You are usually teaching me so many things, and now I can be repaying the favor. It's almost a shame you've got your life mapped out as Queen of Bridget. You'd make a fine academic. I don't suppose I could talk you into it. An academic? Yes, a sort of professional scholar. It takes passion and, more importantly, luck. But you've got both. I do? Well, there's no question you're passionate and a hard worker, which just leaves the luck part. And I'd say you live a charmed life indeed if people are dropping you love letters in the middle of a war. Whatever happened with that, by the way? I gave him my rejection and will never be seeing him again. What? Really? I'm dying to know more, but... Listen, just give the academia thing some thought, all right? You'd be perfect for it. Everything goes well today. I was waiting for you. The breeze feels lovely. Goddess always watches over us, even now. Oh my! And I don't mind taking care of horses. In fact, I wish I could do that for the rest of my life. poor animals for our food. Couldn't we just eat vegetables instead? Is something wrong with my hair? 
I try to make it look ordinary so I don't stand out. to get something to eat? Yeah, you? I am. Shall we go together then? The sure thing. I wonder what they've cooked up for us today. Ah, that was satisfying. Pretty nice getting such tasty meals all the time, huh? I agree. The meal was lovely. You didn't finish your meat again. It's kind of a waste, you know. I eat a lot of the vegetables, so you can have it. Hey, if you're offering... Wait a minute. Haven't we had this conversation before? <laughs> I think we have. Did something happen to you, Marianne? You seem more... relaxed today. In a good way, of course. No, nothing in particular, but I made a decision. I'm not going to worry about whether I bring misfortune to others or not. I've been a part of this army for a while now, and I've worked closely with everyone in it. And nothing terrible has happened to anyone as a result of being around me. Well, of course nothing bad's happened. I'm still a bit anxious about everything, but... I decided to adopt a more easygoing attitude. I'd like to emulate you and your nonchalant demeanor, how you can just move through the world without a care. <laughs> You're making me sound kind of irresponsible. But you know what? I'm okay with that. I say if you want to talk to people, then talk to them. If you want to be alone, then do that. I really think it's best to just be yourself. Don't force anything. Yes, I think so too. But I fear my adoptive father might chastise me again if I say that to him. Yeah, he'll probably still tell you to make more of an effort. Most likely, yes. But hey, you never know. I don't think he'll be as insistent about it if he saw you now. You might not have noticed, but you're a lot different than you used to be. You're definitely somewhat sociable. More so, even. I just hope that's good enough for him. I'd like to think it will be. Well, I mean, I guess I don't really know what kind of guy your father is. Sometimes I think you say whatever pops into your head without thinking. I suppose that's what I like about you, isn't it? I can already tell I'm going to learn a lot from you. Uh, I wouldn't go that far.
The fight starts now. Let's all make it out of this alive. Oh, if I must. Leave this to me. I'll do my best. I'm a little nervous about this. Begin. The sky... Not a problem. I've got... Do you want me to lay an ambush? about this oh if I must leave this to me not a problem I've got this leave this what a pain I'm swapping in Begin. The Sky Spirit watches over me. Take a breather. Is that all we've got? My turn. Not a problem. I've got this. I can't just... Here I go! I have finished with great success. Attack! You know what they say about playing with fire. We did it! for defeat here. You probably won't sway, but I... I'll do my best. I'm a little nervous about this. I'm a little nervous about this. Recommend a swift withdrawal. I'm swapping in.
win the next one, too, if I just stay focused. I won't let my... There must be... We have a duty to fulfill. You don't expect me to go out there and fight, do you? For Lady Edelgard! Another step toward victory. our virtue firsthand. Conduct a rescue quickly. We can ill afford any losses. Together, we will turn this disadvantage back in our favor. Advance, please. I will gladly handle this. Orders received. There is not a question of can. Only a matter of will. Leave this to me. It's Bernie's time to shine! Sure hope this goes okay. Go. No, must they must learn who they're up against. Hard to help me. Help me! Someone! Anyone! Let us bring this stronghold down efficiently. We'll make good use of this. Wouldn't you say?
It's Bernie's time to shine! Sure hope this goes okay. There's not a question of can't. Leave the... Oh, rousing success. Position secured. Let's carve a swath through the battlefield. Mission complete. Already lost. I will end you. It's Bernie's time to shine! Sure hope this goes okay. I will gladly have orders received. Who shall pay for this? You hear? I can't believe that works! This. I can still fight! Let's carve a swamp through the battlefield! Think I was careless. All would be lost if I were to die here. There is not a question of can. Leave this to me. I will gladly handle this. Orders received. I will glad orders received. There's not a question of can. Only a matter of leave this to me. Did you all see how marvelous I was? <laughs> Let us begin. <laughs> I will gladly handle this. I am here to aid you. It's Bernie's time to shine! Do you need some backup? There's not a question of can. Well, my... I do hope you'll make this fun for me. My apologies, but we require immediate support. Stand down! I 
能。The only acceptable outcome. You have taken another step forward. You've already lost. I will end you. I'm all right. Knowing when to retreat is a vital stretch. I'm truly glad the rescue was a success. I must out... I need more. Oh, this is. What you think? How'd it go? Any results a good result. <laughs> <laughs> 